So I'm out here testing out this new hoodie that I picked up from Appalachian Gear Company. Uh, it's an alpaca fleece hoodie. Uh, it's very comfortable so far. Uh, temperatures out here are about uh, low 30s, around 34 degrees. And uh, wind speeds are about uh, 20 miles per hour. So it is pretty chilly today, so I figured this would be a good, uh, good way to test out the fleece. Let you know what I think. The Appalachian Gear Company Alpaca Fleece Hoodie retails for about $145 and is only available through the manufacturer's website. It's made from 100% alpaca fiber. According to the manufacturer, alpaca fiber doesn't absorb much moisture, dries really quickly, and continues to insulate even when wet. It's also more environmentally friendly than synthetic fibers. It's a loose fitting, bare bones hoodie with no pockets and no zippers. The look of the fabric resembles old school wool, not merino, but it doesn't have that itchy feel of wool and is very soft and comfortable. My hoodie is size double XL and it weighs 14.85 ounces. That puts it right between my Melanzana micro grid hoodie at 14.04 ounces and the Patagonia R1 at 15.84 ounces. Sizing runs large, so I could probably get away with the XL and still be comfortable, but I don't mind the extra space since I prefer loose fitting clothes. On this hike, the temp started in the low 30s with a strong wind chill, and I definitely felt a bit chilly to start the hike with only a tech tee under the alpaca hoodie. As the day went on, the temps went up to the low 40s, and that felt like the sweet spot for this piece of gear. If using a rain jacket to block the wind, I probably would have been more comfortable in the colder temps, but I wanted to test it without any layers over it to get a good idea where it would be comfortable. I'm happy to add this hoodie to my gear closet, and we'll probably use it hiking in temps between 40 to 50 degrees Fahrenheit, or lounging around camp in temps up to the 60s. For sub-freezing temps, I would stick with the Melly or the R1, but this alpaca hoodie could definitely work with the right layering system. If you can catch it in stock, it's worth picking one up. They tend to sell out fast, so I would suggest you try getting on their email list so you can get the alert when they get them back in stock. I'm not affiliated with the company, but I'll leave a link to the site in the description below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching.